Hello guys, welcome to Tech Fire channel. In today's video, we are going to discuss about digital interview preparation and also we will discuss about the interview date and is that interview is virtual or in person then what are the technologies to prepare and also we will discuss about the doubts that many people has. So don't skip the video, subscribe to tech for your channel and click on the bell icon to get more useful updates. Okay, many people actually have these doubts. First I will discuss about is the results are completely out. The results are not completely out. Some people have got the shortlisted mail for the interview by yesterday and some people have got by today also. So there is a chance to get for tomorrow. If you are not selected for the interview then you will be getting the regret mail. If you get the regret mail it is not considered that you don't have the ninja offer also. So if you did not get the interview mail for digital then you will be stayed with your ninja offer. You are not upgraded but you are staying with the ninja offer so don't worry you will be having your ninja offer. It won't be cancelled. Okay now coming to this question. So many people have done two codings but they did not get the interview mail. The first reason for this is as I told already the results are completely not out. So if you did not get the result or the regret mail please wait or mail to explore to get your results. So by tomorrow also there is a chance to get the digital interview result. If you did not clear then you will be getting the regret mail. So the first reason is the results are completely not out. The second reason is as I told earlier in my videos that if you are clearing both the coding questions is not enough to clear your digital exam. You have to concentrate on each sections equally. You also have to do well in your aptitude verbal and reasoning at least by 50 to 75 percent. Okay next question is related to whether interviews are virtual or in person. Okay interviews are not virtual it is in person interview which means you will be given and when you so you will be going to that particular TCS office and you will be attending your interview for digital you can't attend your interview from home you have to go to that particular place other doubt related to this interview is some of them might have the semester exams merged with this interview dates so those people can mail to explore and ask to reschedule their interview dates in order to do your interview at your available time. So if you have the semester exams on the time of the interview date, you can request them to reschedule your interview dates. But definitely everyone should attend the interview so that you can upgrade to your digital package. At least give it a try, don't leave it as it is. Whoever got the mail for digital interview, go and attend the interview there. Okay, next one I would like to say is some people have got the interview dates on 8th April 2023 which is after two days. So today they have got. So hereafter if you get some interview dates then you will be getting two days before itself of the interview. For example your interview is on 9th April 2023 then you will be getting by tomorrow which is 7th April 2023. And one more important thing is check your spam mail also so that you won't miss your important details on interview. Okay, now how to prepare for the interview? The first question in every interview is tell me about yourself. Normally for this question everybody will be telling about yourself. So added to those things I would say one suggestion which is whichever the technology or something you are better or you are good at. You make a note while you are telling about yourself so that they will be raising the questions from those topics and you can also able to clear easily. Then there is a chance of asking the questions on your project since you are in your final year. So you will be doing the final year projects and you have already done your mini projects. So there will be a questions related to your projects. So you have to fully prepared on your projects like what technology you are using in your project and what is the advantage of those technology while using on your projects and if it is a hardware project then prepare on what are the components you are doing in your project if it is a software prepared on whatever the software is then there is also a chance of asking oops and data structure concepts in your interview oops concepts like class objects abstraction inheritance polymorphism encapsulations and from data structure they can ask like q stack linked list then tree concepts so make sure you prepare on most important oops and data structure concepts. 
then more chances to get the questions from cloud concepts like what is meant by private public and hybrid cloud then they might ask about the cloud services and also refer to some of the important technologies like artificial intelligence or machine learning then iot big data cyber security blockchain devops then finally you will be getting the questions whether you have any questions or not so at that time you can use your opportunity to know about them or their project etc so whatever you are thinking so you can ask them then one more important thing is be prepared on your whole resume make sure to know about each and every word on your resume and whatever you mentioned in your resume prepare everything based on that hope this video helps you subscribe to tech for your channel and click on the bell icon to get more useful updates meet you in the next video thank you for watching